I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. Yes, I know. I'm a freaking idiot. I didn't pay attention to instructions. I wasn't watching or paying close enough attention to what the game was trying to tell me when I got the BFG. So I totally screwed it up. I actually had the BFG the entire time. Those green things on the ground that I didn't know what the heck they were. It was ammo for the BFG. I could have been using it during that fight that I had uh, all those freaking people running around. We could have seen some cool explosions and stuff out of uh, demons and stuff. And I just totally screwed it off because I'm an idiot. So uh, we're going to try to go ahead and, and fix that. Uh, we're heading on to the next mission. Uh, mission number nine says, you are at the heart of the UAC called the Lazarus Labs. This is where Olivia released the demons from their cells and activated the Lazarus Wave, turning UAC personnel into unwilling possessed. You are in search of her private offices where the Helix Stone is stored. Unlock the secrets of this sacred artifact to find out how to shut down the well, the Argent Tower's energy source in hell. Okay, so we have to... She established some kind of permanent... Um, portal between hell and mars and we have to shut it down for good and this well is the energy source so we have to be able to shut down this well and the only way to do that is to get this artifact from her office from the crazy cyborg lady's office and like i said i was an idiot this is called lazarus this is mission number nine i was an idiot i had bfg the entire time the reason i didn't see it when i was scrolling through my weapons is because i had to press t to get it out. You'll find the Helix Stone in an idiot. private archival lab deep within I know. this facility. Few have ever seen the stone. But if you came to us for a reason, you might be able to see something in it we haven't. Shut down the portal. Oh god, there's a bunch of demons swarm in this. Access the Helix Stone. Alright, well something tells me that I might need the BFG here too. So maybe it's a good thing that I'm full up on the BFG ammo. I don't know. Let's check something out right quick. How close am I to this stupid upgrade on this dang shotgun? Only eight. Oh my God. I feel like I've killed so many of them by now. It is not a mistake that he has come into our possession. The demons prophesized his return. If he awakes, it could jeopardize the entire mission. For he is the only one who can stand against them. She talking about me. I'm pretty cool, man. I don't know if you knew this, but I'm a big deal. All right, we're good on the uh, chainsaw. We can't go anywhere else. All right, looks like we got a forge straight ahead into this. Going on here. Attention to all Lazarus personnel. There will be an open forum Codex entry. Oh, siphon grenade. The initiative to weaponize the the siphon grenade was Report designed to. to... 1400 hours. Please I'll wait. Before attending. The siphon grenade was designed to work with the Doom Marine's Praetor suit, specifically to make use of the Argent receptors found in the gloves and chest plates. The grenade has three stages. When primed, the grenade releases releases a positively charged particle field around itself and the operator's hand. Then, when the grenade is released and explodes, it releases a negatively charged particle field over a distance of a few meters. The negatively charged particles attract argent plasma from any demon caught in the radius, tearing the plasma from their cells. Finally, the positively charged Praetor suit then attracts the negatively charged argent cloud and gathers the plasma this siphons energy back into the suit partially healing the doom marine oh that's cool so it's like a health grenade kills them heals me i like that is that what happened to you guys on oh, you guys turned into like human soup over here is that what you guys were doing what were you blabbering about nobody really knows all right wait what's this Ooh, a little pentagram thing going on okay uh, none of you guys have anything good, right? If you're losing faith, do not influence others. Be strong and accept the consequences. Oh. Okay. Hey, everybody. How's it going? You guys are easy. You guys are the easy ones to kill. Aw, oh, dang it, you killed him before I could kill him. 
I wanted to kill him. Anything hidden around over here? I don't think so. Oh God, no, 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 no. I hate those stupid guys. Those guys are easy. Pretty good there. We didn't miss anything so far, looks like. Oh, crap. Oh, man. We just ran into each other. Good. How many did that take? Hang on. How many did that take? It took three, just like the uh, um, Hell Knights. So I'm just going to try to... You know what? Hang on. Let's go grab that ammo right quick. Oh, we can't. It was upstairs. Never mind. I can't jump back up there. I was going to go grab that... Uh, that gasoline for the... What was that? Oh. Oh, hi, everybody. Oh, okay. Hang on, hang on. I, I got a shotgun for you. Hang on. Let me get my shotgun out. I'm working on a shotgun thing. I don't know how I'm not getting that. No idea how I'm not getting a freaking hit on that, but whatever. What is this? Ammo? Where am I supposed to go? Oh, they were just hiding down there? I wasn't actually supposed to go down there. Is that right? Okay, that's not a thing, apparently. What is that? Ooh. Hey, everybody! Where'd you go? You don't want to meet my chainsaw? Oh, I don't have enough ammo for it anyways. Never mind. Where are you going? Stop running. There we go. Finally got it. Were there any more imps anywhere? All right, there's the big guy. All right, big guy's down. There we go. Okay, 20 out of 10. Or 10 out of 20, sorry. All right, if we go... Wait. Okay, that's not an imp. If we go over there and... Uh, Rip this heart out of this thing. I think it's basically going to start a war. It's going to start me in battle here. There we go. Yep. Yep. That's what I thought was going to happen. Any more imps? Oh, hello. That's an imp. Oh, God. There we go. 11 out of 20. Yes. I saw an imp. There we go. 12 out of 20. Yes. Now I saw a hell knight running around. There we go. 13 out of 20. Yes. I'm doing pretty good. Hello, hell knight. There's a grenade. Oh. All right. 14 out of 20. Yes. I'm doing good. I'm finally going to get this thing done. Thank goodness. I'm trapped. I'm trapped. Okay. Crap. Okay. This is not good. Oh, they're all hitting me. You guys are all ganging up on me. Oh, wait, what did I get? Haste. Oh, yes. There 
There we go. Oh, crap. Low health. Oh! There we go. Give me health. There we are. We need some more armor. There it is. 16 out of 20. We're doing pretty good. Seventeen, nice. We're gonna get it, guys. Where'd you go? Crap! I missed. I totally missed that. Where are the big guys? Hang on. I keep trying to find that weapon. Here's that shoddy again. Let's just try to get this done. And then we can just... There we go. We just got two more. One more. And then I don't have to worry about this anymore. Come on. And that one didn't count. Crap. We're going to have to do it again. Finally. Weapon mastery. All right. Hang on. Let's check that out. We got weapon mastery now. Getting a direct hit with an explosive shot will spawn cluster bombs. All right, that's what it is. Cluster bombs. Well, let's try that out. Uh, I didn't see any cluster bombs. I still didn't see any cluster bombs. Am I missing something? I don't know, man. There's a big guy, though, and I'm going to use the BFG. We haven't really used that yet, so let's go ahead. Hi, buddy. Oh, where are you jumping? Oh, that is so cool. Oh, yes. The BFG is really sweet. Oh, ow. What are we doing? Did we kill everyone? Hang on. I hear something. There we go. All right. Did we miss anything? I can clearly hear them moaning and groaning. What are we doing? Rockets are good. I think everything is pretty good. Hey, everybody. Volunteers are currently needed. Ow. Go beyond mere moral limitations. See Jessica and human resources to find out if you qualify. No, I don't think so. I think I'm good, man. Where am I supposed to go? Up here? Oh, come on now. The Revenant Program. Helping UAC members become all that they can do. Is there something up here? What's going on? Wait. There we go. Another Praetor upgrade or another Praetor token. What is this? What did I pick up? Oh, here we go. Codex entry. Elite guard. UAC employees are advised to comply with any orders received from an elite guard. Their jurisdiction is absolute, answering only to the highest level executives at the UAC. If an elite guard kindly requests that you accompany them to the Lazarus Labs, you'll be going to the Lazarus Labs. With such powerful capabilities in each elite guard, it was deemed necessary to implant a kill chip in each uniform so that they might also be controlled should an uprising occur among their ranks. The kill chip responds to a Lazarus wave signature that can only be broadcasted by Samuel Hayden or Olivia Pierce. Screw that. I would not want that chip in my uniform. There'd be no way I'd be an elite guard then. So they can kill you. That's That'd be easily... Easily manipulated to just kill someone if you don't like them. Heck no, I'm not doing that. No way I'd volunteer for that. Olivia activated the hell wave from somewhere inside this facility. I did hope she could rise above their influence. I was wrong. She proved 
proved to be weaker than I thought you'd be. Hmm. Okay, we got another combat support drone weapon modification. I think this this time I'm gonna roll with the stun bomb. We need some type of modification for our plasma rifle. And I think the stun bomb is the best one. That way it'll stun a demon and then I can use uh what are those glory kills and just kill it. Just take it out, you know what I mean? You know what I mean. Come on. Oh my god, dude. Get up the hole! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, why was I having so much trouble with that? That's so stupid. There we go. We got some ammo. Let's check out the new mod we got. I just saw something walk behind there. That was pretty big. What? Did you just throw a mop bucket at me? Is that what you did? Did you think a mop bucket was really going to do anything? What do we got here? Monsters, a cyber demon. Oh God, we haven't come into contact with him. All right, so I think I found a new favorite. This guy looks pretty, uh, pretty sweet. I think my favorite before was the Baron of Hell, simply because of how he looked. He looked pretty sweet. But this, hang on, the cyber demon. Let's go to this decoded entry. The cyber demon looks pretty sweet. I think he's my new favorite. He looks awesome. The Corax tablets discovered during the UAC automated survey of 2143 mention an ancient battle in the Titan's realm during the Third Age. An expedition to the plains recovered several relics, including the petrified remains of a massive shadow lord believed to be an ancient Balgar demon. Researchers in the Lazarus Labs began work on piecing the creature back together. At first, the project mandate was to construct an educational and inspirational exhibit. However, the focus quickly shifted when an attempt to meld the petrified tissue uncovered that exposure to small doses of plasmic argent energy would reanimate the relic. The potential of creating living, growing tissue from the relic and the lure of an ultimate battle demon was too enticing to pass up. The project team quickly shifted direction and began work on melding the ancient remains with the high-tech weapon. What? Why? Why? Why, 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 why? No. Someone needs like some common sense in this game. Whoa. Have I been missing these? Like... Is this stuff I could have... Could I have been knocking out these things the entire time? Is this where he was? Oh, God. Something tells me this is where he was. Oh, I bet you that's where the Belgar demon was. Let's see. Lazarus Labs. Yep. Look, Belgar demon. Lazarus Labs is a subdivision of the Advanced Research Complex and is only accessible at the highest clearance levels. Located deep underground to prevent infiltration, the Lazarus Labs are home to the longest serving and most dedicated UAC staff. Information regarding the Lazarus Project is hard to come by as members are highly secretive and well-disciplined. What is known is that any cross-dimensional anomalies, entities, or artifacts are immediately sent to the Lazarus Labs for research and are never seen again. However, promotion to the Lazarus Project is considered a badge of honor among UAC staff, despite not knowing exactly what their work will entail. I guarantee you that's what was in here is that big freaking cyber demon thing. Is there a way for me to get out of here? How do I get out of here? Hello? Oh, wait, is this where I came from? I think it is. All right. So we're just going to go right back up the way we came. Oh, yep. Duh. There we go. That's the top portion of it right there. That's what I saw uh, walking away not that long ago. Oh, nice throw, idiot. Wait. Ha <laughs> ha 
You thought you was gonna get me, but you did. Can I go in here? No. Ooh, there's a rune in there though. How do I get in there? Hang on a second. Oh wait, you guys can open those doors too? Ooh, nice. Suck on that for a little bit. Okay. Is there a way for me to get in here to get in these rooms? Maybe I have to continue going ahead. Maybe I'll come back to it. Oh, yes. That mod, this mod for the plasma gun is going to come in awesome. If I can just stun these guys with the shield. Oh, that's going to be another way to easily kill these guys. Can I go in here? Nope. I can't. Oh, crap. Wait, that's what they're doing right now is they're reanimating that. All right, he's dead. Good. They're literally trying to reanimate that guy right now as we speak. Okay, hang on. Let's go get refilled on ammo real fast. All right, so we got to get down there and try. Oh, they're still working on him? All right, we got to get down there before that thing is uh, done putting him back together. What is that? Nothing? Just like a saw? I'm stuck. Okay. Let's not do that. Anything you got over here for me? Anything I can use? Huh? That's not a new gun, is it? Here we go. Here's health. All right, let's get down there before that guy comes back to life. Hey, everybody. Oh, God. They're, they don't like me being down here. They are not happy with me being down here. Sweet. Oh my god, my health. There we go. Give me some more health. What else is around me? Oh, yes. Oh my god, yes. Thank god you can get health back by, like, meleeing these guys. Oh, screw you, buddy. Because I desperately need it. Oh, there's portals there. Oh, I might need it. Oh, yep, I will. Come on now. Oh crap, you're right there. Hi, buddy. Uh, T. Woo! Yes! Yes, sir! Yes! I like that. Nope. What? What? Alright, big guy's dead. Thank God. Here we go. Quad. Oh, God. Where are you? There we go. Let's run around. Just kill everyone. I can't move. Whoa, I went through a portal. Okay, I'm going to need help big time. I'm going to get it from over here. Holy crap. Everyone. Thank God that portal was there because I would have been dead. I had 3% health left. Ooh, what is this? Wait a minute. Is this where I'm supposed to go to continue on? Hang on a second. I didn't mean to continue on that fast. I was going to go scavenge around to see what else was left. All right. Well, there was nothing to explore. So we're just going to go ahead and move straight along. Oh, hello. Right in front of my face. Okay. Oh, 
crap 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 okay we gotta look for some place to take uh whoa all right we'll kill him all right he's dead what do we got more guys oh god kill this guy too and this haste really helps out sometimes whoa Yes, we got him too. Nice. Oh God, there's more. Get him. Get him. We need him now. Ah, oh, dang. God dang, kill this dude! Holy crap! Okay, now what is shooting at me? Jeez, dude! Screw off, man! I'm just trying to survive! Oh god, now what? <laughs> okay. Got a little bit ridiculous there for a second. With all those guys that charge. Look at all these uh, artifacts that they've recovered. All these inscriptions and stuff. That's pretty cool. What am I supposed to do? Right here? Is this it? Open sealed area. Okay. Let's do it. Oh, now what? Now where am I going? What? Shut down the portal. Access the Helix Stone. Okay. Something tells me that that wasn't good, what you just said. Did you just cast a spell on me, huh? Oh, that's the Helix Stone right there? I'm just trying to reload all my guns. I don't know what I'm going to do. As soon as I come and touch this, something's going to happen. Guaranteed. Hang on. Before I touch it, I'm going to have a little look around. Uh-huh. You should not have allowed his location to be discovered. You have failed us. It was not me. It was Samuel. He led them to his tomb. Please. We can overcome this. I promise. The gate will be opened as planned. Ooh, who's she talking to? That's Satan. UAC personnel, Olivia. Samuel saw Olivia as a protege. He sponsored her during her formal education and was the driving force behind her promotion to the Global Science Council. Olivia made her fortune as one of the founders of Nanostruct. Aerospace and defense system. In part thanks to a seizable donation from Samuel, Olivia's career blossomed and Samuel eventually offered her the freedom to design and run her own cutting edge laboratory by joining the UAC. Olivia refused, citing that she had no interest in the energy business. When Olivia did finally leave Nanostruck, it, be it came as a shock to the scientific community. She relinquished a position of sizable power and control to work at an isolated outpost 140 million miles from Earth. A former colleague of Olivia's at Nanostruct stated that Samuel sent her an artifact recovered near the Argent Fracture, after which she became obsessed with joining the UAC. A few weeks later, she accepted the offer and became the leader of the Lazarus Project, working directly under Samuel Hayden. And she crazy. Did you, you forgot to mention that. She crazy. Wait a minute, did that do anything to the Helix Stone? Can I access the Helix Stone now? No. Okay. Okay, so that just opened up this little secret laboratory area. Yeah, let's get all healthed up. Oh, wait. This isn't where I was. 
That's the Praetor suit. And that's me in there. <gasps> yes, that's BFG ammo. That's what I'm talking about. I was missing those green things. I was like, what is that? What is that? What is that? The entire time. And uh, yeah, the entire time I just wasn't paying attention and forgot I was supposed to hit a completely different button to bring up the BFG. <gasps> Another upgrade. Let's do health. Because something tells me we're going to need health where we're going. Ugh. All right, let's go ahead and access this. Manual security activated. All terminals now accessible. Okay, so does that mean I can go back to the helix? Wait a minute. Okay, that's full health. If I need full health, at least I know where to go. Watch, I'm going to access this and all hell is going to break loose. Haha, <laughs> get it? Of course you do. Titan's realm, but we'll need to rupture another Argent accumulator to create the portal. The only accumulator in this sector is in specimen CD-587. <laughs> You're going to have to remove it. Once you've extracted the accumulator, it will become unstable. The ruptured casing should cause a rift strong enough to send you back to their world. We can determine your point of entry using the tether system I uploaded to your suit. Retrieving the crucible is critical. Without it, we have no way of shutting down the well and closing the hell portal here on Mars. I knew it. All hell's breaking loose. Yep, that's what I thought. Plasma rifle is actually pretty good, especially now with this, uh, like stun thing. Oops. There we go. Get rid of that guy. And these little, uh, imps actually don't take too much before you can, uh, perform a glory kill on them. Where's, uh, give me a big gun. All right, there we go. Let's take this guy out really quick. Man, this double barrel shotgun is really awesome. It still packs a freaking punch, man. All right, gauze cannon. We still have some gauze cannon ammo. Let's see. Let's try to get as much health as we can right now on these little guys. Where'd you go? There you are. Oh, that's it? Everyone's gone? Oh, nice. Oh, what's going on here? Okay, secret stairwell, huh? Leading to hell? Is this Olivia Pierce's secret portal to hell? Oh my god, it actually might be. I was just kidding. I didn't really think it was. Stupid shield guy, get out of here. No one likes you, shield guy. Oh my god, die, dude! Now you see why I hate these shield guys? What is wrong with you? 
Don't you know how to die? Jeez. All right, so this actually might be Olivia Pierce's. Oh. Who did you kill for that? What is going on here? Is that just going to keep playing over and over again? So there's just a bunch of stabbing going on here. Screw you, Skull. All right, looks like we got two ways to go. Hopefully they just lead up to the same place. Well, maybe not. Maybe this is a, just a complete dead end, huh? What's going on over here, guys? Huh? Ooh. Oh, God. Is this going to start something again? Am I supposed to be on top of this? I don't know if I am. I don't think I am. Oh, it's a secret. Get another upgrade. Okay. Now where am I supposed to go? Is that it? Cycle hatch? Oh, okay. There we go. Okay, so I was supposed to get on this. Well, luckily I didn't get up the first time because I wouldn't have found that secret. Call elevator. Wait, am I supposed to go down here? Maintenance only? Is this where I'm supposed to go? Hey, everybody. Whoa. Here, suck on that. I don't know if this is where I'm supposed to go or not. I have no idea even if this is the right place for me to go. Well, this is a dead end. Crap. Come on, get him now. He's hurting. Woo. That was actually pretty lucky because I ran out of big ammo. I need to find some more big ammo. What's going on down there? Oh, hey. All right, let's try to get as much health as we can from these guys. All right, 127, not bad. Things are getting spooky. You know what red means. Red means scary. What the heck is that? Lazarus wave at full charge, ready for activation. This hell wave will redirect the course of mankind. On this day, we make our contribution to their cause. Our salvation lies with them. I pulled you from that tomb in the Cadenger Sanctum for this reason. I know she was weak. Our work doesn't come without risks, and I released you from your prison to help mitigate those risks. I knew that in the event of a catastrophe, you'd be the only thing that could stop them. Alright, so before I hit that, I'm gonna load up on health. 
because I have no idea what that's gonna do whatever it is probably isn't gonna be good entry lock security station activation required is that what this is close portal okay yeah let's close the portal that's good right that's a good thing portal sealed good warning power to holding cells interrupted what was in the holding cells excuse me what was in the holding cells So the power to the holding cells were interrupted. That can't be a good sign. What the heck? Is there anything in here? No? Oh god, what the heck is going on there? Let's get some ammo. At least we know that's good for us. Entry is locked. Of course it is. Why wouldn't it be? Let's check this other side. Is there anything over here that I can use? Doesn't appear that way. All right, so it looks like there's only one way to go. And that's through here. Maybe we'll be able to see what holding cells were unlocked. Can't get in there. Demonic what the heck? Safe oh my god. Goss cannon, super shot. Rocket launcher. Hang on, where's my trusty shotgun? There we go. Oh, where am I? Give me that eyeball. Yes. Okay, time to move. Holy crap. Being in the middle is not safe, apparently. Going back to my little safe spot. All right, let's try to get a handle on the situation. We got guys standing on things. Where's my heavy assault? Come on, man. Oh, there we go. All right, screw that guy. He would not die. There we go. We'll try to get some headshots on these guys. There we go. Now we can do some long distance damage. Need some of that health. 85% not too bad Hang on, give me something with a scope There we go We got health right across the way straight over there and down there. Okay. We have some on the bottom level too. All 
right, 25. That gives us 150. There we go. He's dead. Try to be safe about this. Like conservative. Jeez, dude. 115 already. Yes, get that guy. All right. Oh. Stupid shield, guys. I don't even want to mess with those guys. Where are you running from? <laughs> Where you keep going, man? That guy was trying to get away from me. Oh, I missed that guy completely. All right, we gotta be, we gotta be kind of play conservative a little bit. I don't want to use my big guns on these little guys. That's for sure. Let's see, what do we got? Chain gun, pistol. Ow, dude. Okay, never mind. We're losing too much health. I can't be doing that stuff. Here we go. Here's some health. Crap, crap, crap. All right, we got to move. Holy crap, I need help. Bad. Gather up all this health. Get the heck out of here. All right, we're doing... Per Ow, I'm stuck. God dang it. I was going to say we're doing pretty good, but I keep getting stuck on stuff. You have to move so fast in this game that, like, it's so easy to get stuck on stuff. God, how many are around me? My goodness gracious, dude. They just keep coming. Holy crap. Okay, are we done? All right, biggins. We still got biggins down there. Crap. Hang on, I got something for you. All right, screw off, dude. Demonic presence eliminated. Lockdown disengaged. Jeez. About time. All right, so I looked around a little bit. I didn't see any more health. So uh, I think that's about it. I think that's everything for now that we can do. Let's go ahead and see what happens next. I'm in the elevator. Isn't this where I'm supposed to be? You will need to rip out the Argent accumulator powering the Cyber Demon. Destabilizing the core will cause a rift that will send you back to hell. Oh. Once the crucible is in your possession, we will pull you out. Okay, is that why there's so much armor and everything going on here? Max armor, max ammo. Holy crap. This is going to be a battle, isn't it? All right, we're full up on... <laughs> Armor and health. Let's see what this thing is. Monsters, the cyber demon. Holy crap. All right. During the cyber demon reanimation project, the beast was kept alive by controlling the amount of plasmic argent energy it received. 
This kept the beast in an effectively brain dead state while additional components were cybernetically implanted. A neural pathway was created between the creature's brain and the Argent accumulator, allowing the creature to administer Argent power to any part of its body as needed. In hindsight, this neural pathway was a mistake, as once the pathway was activated, the dormant beast immediately administered an Argent surge to the medulla oblongata, which allowed it to restore motor function. Once active, the circulatory system was quickly restored and the beast achieved full motor function within a few minutes. It is only through the bravery of follower Jacobson that the beast was contained. Follower Jacobson willingly gave his own life as bait when he lured the giant cyber demon into holding pen six where it could be contained. Unfortunately, there was no way to retrieve Jacobson once the doors had been bolted and he was sacrificed. Well, Jacobson, good job, but something tells me that uh, your sacrifice was done in vain because of some crazy lunatic named Olivia Pierce. Holy crap, that guy's big. God dang it. Whoa, dude. He didn't even give me a time to chance to do anything. Crap. What is going on? You got plenty of weapons at your disposal, don't you? Please don't hit me. Please don't hit me. All right, watch out. They're going to come down from the sky again. Jeez. There we go. Oh, crap. Hang on. Wait, I got one more shot at this. Where's... Jeez. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Where's my, where's my thing that'll stun him? Plasma. Did that do anything? Jeez, dude. There we go. I need health. I need health and ammo now. Crap. Okay, let's switch weapons up. We're going to go with this for now. All right, take a break while we dodge. <sighs> Holy crap, that was close. Come on, get him. Go, 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 finish him, finish him. What? 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 We gotta battle him again? Oh crap, I can't do that. Oh, I'm in trouble. Oh. And there's my head. Okay, well, I wasn't expecting that. All right, here we go again. Back in hell. Jump. Duck. Jump. Duck. We got to keep moving. Oh, my God. Come on.
Come on, get him. What was that? I have no idea what the heck that was. Where's my chain gun? All right, we're overheated. We have to wait. Oh God. We have to watch out for that. That thing is deadly. If it hits you, you're just, you're just dead. Holy crap, holy crap. Okay. Look for a place, look for a place. My god, I cannot stop moving. What the flying? Oh my god, just fucking kill me. Fuck me. God fucking damn it. Oh god. Mother flying fuck man. Jump, duck, jump. Oh God, we gotta watch out. Seriously, I got hit already? I don't know. Christ almighty, you fucking cheating piece. Oh my fucking God. Oh my fucking God. Jump, oh, what? Get the fuck out of here. My fucking God. I'm going to break this computer. Oh. oh God. Holy crap. Find an empty space. <gasps> I don't know. Video. This is test test one two. Fuck off. Jump, duck, jump. All right, we gotta watch out for this. Jump, duck, jump. Run, 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 run. What? Oh, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Do you see how close? Oh, oh, my God. Do you see how close we are on health right now? Holy crap. Oh, we got a new codex for the freaking cyber demon. Oh, my God. Wait a minute. Why couldn't he have pulled me back right then? The good doctor had the ability to pull me back, he said, whenever he wanted to. And he just decided not to pull me back? Concerted to be the most significant marker of success in the development of Argent Organic Research, the Cyber Demon is the flagship creation of the Lazarus Project. What the hell, dude? No, he is not the flagship. No. The symbiotic union of the Balgar Demon found during the second project, Lazarus Manned Expedition, and the Argent Accumul Accumulator, this beast is capable of withstanding so much punishment that the creature must be kept in permanent suspended animation. Repeated attempts to subdue the beast prove unsuccessful as when exhausted, the cyber demon simply replenishes its life force from the accumulator and attacks again with greater ferocity. Only with removing the Argent implant can the beast be restrained. The cyber demon remains in stasis until a suitable method of control can be found. Holy crap. Well, it reanimated itself once I uh, ripped out that accumulator anyways. So what does that matter? Maybe it gets its life force from hell? I'm not so sure. And like I said, Samuel Hayden has the ability to pull me out of hell, but uh, he decided not to do that for some reason. Holy crap, man. That was a fight for the ages. I'll tell you what, that is crazy. But that's all the time I have for today, guys. Let me know what you thought of this episode. There was a lot bigger and better fights in this episode than I think I've ever encountered before in Doom. And I will see you guys in the next episode of Doom.